I just did a tour to states. I fucking that bitch in the back of the whip, let my chick do a tour her face. I travel through space and time, that's why I called the DeLorean race. I know I'm a pretty motherfucker, she tell me that I look like Dorian Gray. I am not an alcoholic, but I'm still racking in almost 40 a day. Yeah, I'm on my ignorant shit, I just finished my valedictorian phase. Yeah, I'm on my innocent shit for that bitch with my Jacob Sartorius face. Hey, new music on the way. You know, today I was just minding my own business, celebrating the national holiday of the one year anniversary of Die Lit. When all of a sudden I get a bunch of notifications from people saying, Bro, this this hip hop legend Twista just reacted to you on Genius. You gotta check this out. You know, it's as he reacts to new fast rappers, there's Ski Mask, JID, and then me. I'm a little worried because, you know, Ski Mask and JID, they're like some of the best artists in my opinion. Like, I don't think I'm on their level yet, you know? Just being in that same title is already kind of crazy, but I'm, you know, I'm hoping he likes it. I'm very excited. I used to listen to that song, Overnight Celebrity, so, you know, this, uh, this, uh, really, it really means a lot to me. So let, let's see what it, what he says. What up, what up? It's your boy Twister right here. Now, I'm up here at Genius, and I'm gonna give y'all my take on who I think can spit that fast flow the best. Okay, so, okay, so it's the fast rappers. Personally, I, I do have sort of a mixed relationship with rapping fast. You know, it's, it's fun to do it just as a skill, but I think a lot of people overhype rapping fast. You know, I, I had a pretty good conversation with uh, Adam22 about it, where I'm just, I'm just gonna play this little clip. That's one thing. Dude, this is a fucking quote. Think about this. I've been thinking about this for like 10 years. Somebody said, there's nothing harder than slow rap. Mm. Because if you rap slow, it's the ultimate test of if you are believable and if your material is really that good. You know, I kind of agree with that. I've sort of been changing my approach. I will do some fast bars here and there, but when I do them, the content is of the, of the lyrics is always gonna be more important than just rapping fast for me. It wasn't a conscious thing to rap fast. I think it was a conscious thing to be different. Mm. It's one thing to be able to rap fast, then it's another thing to be able to rap fast and do it clearly. It adds on to it when you got a dope cadence. Then it adds on to it even more when you're talking about something, when your subject matter is dope and you got some punchlines or meaning to what you're saying. So it's definitely yeah. not just about the fast flow. It's a combination of all of them. I agree with Get that. Let's skip to where he's talking about me. I think it's right around here. Come right at the Ivy League. She wasn't really okay, I'm gonna listen for a second, but right off top, I just flat out don't like it. What you mean you just flat out don't like it? But listen, if two for two and a half seconds, bro. Okay, no, no, I'm not gonna, not, not getting offended or anything. I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll give him a chance. Okay. Just right off top, though, soon as I heard it. Bam! I just didn't like it. I treat them all like a rivalry. Shitting on you, can I please get some privacy? I'm killing you quietly. I don't like how sweater fit on his body, neither. It's too loose off the neck and it's hanging around the edge a little too much. Now, see, I don't want the shorty to blow up and then not like me. Like a month or two. What you mean, bro? This is, this is a dope sweater. This is my favorite, this is my favorite sweater. And it's not a, no, it's not a big deal. He's just joking around, you know? It's just like, it's just like a sweater. It's not a big deal, you know? Uh. Like a month or two and shit, and then this is the little popping motherfucker. I'd be like, damn, you know what I mean? I could clearly hear that he can rap. All right, well, that's good. He, he can clearly hear that I can rap. All right, I'll take that. That's a compliment. So, I, I you know, I guess I'm, I'm happy about that. He did... Hmm. It's not my favorite, it's my favorite sweater. But, I'll keep nah, it's, just, it's a little corny to me, I just don't like this shit, nah. A little corny, what, what? I clearly hear that he can rap, but. Run that back. Nah, it's just, it's a little corny to me, I just don't like the shit, nah. He fucked it up real bad with that sweater. I'm telling you, that's the first thing I, I ain't like the big ass sweater. All right, what the, f okay. Not liking the song, that's one thing. Yeah, yeah, oh, uh, he's a little corny. Okay, that's fine. Okay. That's fine, you can say that. You know, they didn't, they didn't, I don't think they, they showed you my best song. If I was watching that for the first time and, uh, you know, I only watched maybe 30 seconds, I would say, okay, yeah, he, he might be a little corny. I'm not, I'm not insulting you for that. Cause you know, everybody, they have a different, different opinions, different first impressions, you know? But to say that you don't like this sweater over four, four times? That's... What are you wearing, bro? You're wearing a fucking, looks like someone printed a bunch of South American flags and then just put them, put them on a sweater. <laughs> Alright, you know, I'll keep, I'll keep watching. We're not, I guess, I guess we're not done. Let's see. First thing, I ain't like the big ass sweater. Then the next thing I didn't like about it was his raps. The n his raps? What you mean his raps? Ice in my cream, that's Ben and Jerry's. Nobody liking the way that I work. They say blood, sweat, and tears that ain't sanitary. You mean you don't, you mean you don't like that rap? Did a lot, but I'm not even 21. Okay, twist up. Let's, let's look at some of your raps, all right? Well, I couldn't resist because she was thick as hell and so cute. Steady coming at me. She was throwing it all on me. 
and I couldn't leave. She had a big dookie shoe. You know, I'm just, I'm getting a little, I'm getting a little petty, I'll, I'll be honest, that's a little disrespectful. Let's finish this, because I'm sure it can't go for much longer. The next thing I didn't like about it was the way his body was moving when he was trying to spit his verse. Nothing. He couldn't, he, his shit was, he just was, I don't know what, what he was doing, so. And then last, the Oil Can Harry beat. A beat that sound like it was put together with a few kitchen utensils. Some shit out of Sanford and Son's yard. Is it, you know what I'm saying? Really? Like, I thought that beat was hard. Pizza. What you mean? Damn. Michael Bow, the guy who made the beat. Michael, bro, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. It's, it's, it's not fun being out here. And Twista, I get it, okay? He's a little corny white kid who flails his arms up in the air and wears oversized sweaters. But trust me, bro, you do not want it with me. Because I'm sneaky. Okay, I'm, I'm not what I look like. I'm just warning you. That's all I'm going to say. But yeah, you know, I'm not mad at Twista. You know, he only watched like 30 seconds of one of my... Music videos, and I, you know, I, I, he seems like a like a nice dude, like a funny dude. But if you ever disrespect the sweater, ever again, we're gonna have problems. Do you understand? But bro, if I ever catch you in person, I'm bringing you 12 different sizes of this exact sweater, and you're gonna try them on right then and there, and whichever one fits the best, that's the one you're gonna take home. Okay? You don't want to play with me. I like to call this little number striped sweater. The best time to wear a striped sweater is all the time. Bam, I just didn't like it. But now, Twister, if you're watching this shit, I'm just gonna be straight up. I'm a little bit, I'm not upset, I'm just a little bit disappointed. I hope that uh, you continue to check out some of my new shit and you know, you're, you're gonna look at it and you're gonna be like, all right, you know, I made a mistake. What's up, bro? Hey, did you watch that Twister video? Yeah, he's such a I'm reacting to that shit right now. Dumb. Yeah, bro. No, what you think? What you think about that video, bro? Let let the let the people know. Man, I ain't gonna lie, bro. They tried to fry my man, but it, it's not gonna work. <laughs> when we drop this shit, he gonna be like, "Damn, I take what I said back." Bro, that's facts. But now I just felt all oh, y'all deserved a little video response from me just to let you know how I'm feeling. All right, that'll do it for this video. Thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, and yeah, peace.